Going by a combination of factors and features, it looks like August would be a really good month for Shiba Inu and its holders. For new releases to SheBurns, it looks like the Shiba Inu ecosystem will be getting a major boost in the month of August, and in today's video, we'll be taking a deep dive into all of that. Disclaimer What's up, Sheep Army, and welcome back to the channel. If it's your first time here, you want to go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Also, make sure to turn on post notifications by clicking the bell icon so you're the first to know once a new video is uploaded to the channel. Alright, with that said, let's get into today's video. First things first, there have been massive she burns in recent times. You today wrote that, per the Shibarium website, the burn rate of Shiba Inu has considerably increased by nearly 231%. A portion was destroyed and 25 transactions being made were reported by the Shibarium Twitter account about 10 hours ago. Now, bear in mind that this happened strictly on the SheBurn platform. That is, burns on the SheBurn platform have increased by almost 231%, which is crazy. It looks like sheep holders are acting on Shitoshi's recommendation and are deciding to use this poor crypto market as an opportunity to burn as many tokens as they can. Now, of course, there is no way to know for sure whether this is the reason, but it is a thought. With all these burns happening on the sheep burn platform, I think that all of us can agree that the creation of the platform by the dev team was a really good idea. And knowing this, we can trust that other ideas would be good too, especially as they concern sheep burns. One of such ideas is Shibarium. Of course, Shibarium's main deal is not just to be a sheep burner, but it'll definitely contribute to sheep burns. At least that's what the dev team has said. Knowing this, I believe that basically all of us want Shibarium to be launched as soon as possible. Thankfully, while there is yet no specific date for its launch, both Shitoshi and the team that is currently developing Shibarium have said that the Layer 2 solution platform will enter into beta testing phase this quarter, which should be in August. If Shibarium actually gets launched in August, we could really see an even more insane hike in the amount of sheep burns, especially if the crypto market continues the way it is. This period of price dip is a great time to buy sheep to burn because they are a lot more affordable right now. So, if you couple the burns that can happen on Shibarium to the insane burns that are happening on the sheep burn platform right now and will continue to happen, plus a number of other independent sources, we could actually get the circulating supply of sheep quite low. And just in case you're new to this and don't understand why burns are so important, well, the fewer the amount of sheep tokens in circulation, the more profitable the token will be. Now, the only way we can get that amount low enough is by sending as many tokens as possible to an inaccessible wallet. That way, they will no longer be in circulation. The dev team cannot do this alone because the way Shiba Inu is designed, they only have access to tokens that are theirs. So, every SHIB holder has to contribute to SHIB burns, but only if they want to. And that's one of the reasons why we need Chibarium. It'll allow us to burn tokens at an even bigger scale than that of the sheep burn platform. This is one of the reasons why a lot of sheep holders are excited for the launch of Shibarium. That said, Shibarium isn't the only thing that the Shiba Inu community is looking forward to. There is also the Shiba Inu stablecoin which will enlarge the use cases for the Shiba Inu ecosystem and Shitoshi says that it will be launched this year. In fact, some industry experts are already predicting that this launch could be quite explosive for the Shiba Inu ecosystem, and really, it's not that hard to believe. Now, it is understandable if the idea of Shiba Inu launching a stablecoin makes you wary considering what happened at Terra's UST. However, this is something that the Shiba Inu dev team has considered. So, they've done some research into what could have caused the crash and have started taking steps into making sure that Shiba Inu's stablecoin, she, doesn't make the same mistakes. Already, the news of an upcoming development like this has been good for the Sheep token. According to Zai Crypto, the Shiba Inu's Sheep token continued to display strength in the wake of the news and has been trading in a tight range for the past three days. Despite suffering a painful beatdown in the past half, the token has risen by over 45% in the last three weeks with more investors accumulating the token amid speculations of the Shibarium protocol. Now, if speculations could see the price of SHIB pump this significantly, then one can imagine what the actual launch would do to the price of SHIB. This is one more reason why there is a lot of yearning for the launch of Shibarium, and every other thing that the Shiba Inu dev team has to offer. They'll be good for the ecosystem and even the sheep token specifically. So we wait. 
Interestingly, it isn't just those that are already sheep holders that seem excited about all these potential new developments. But before we get into that, this channel has a daily giveaway of 100,000 sheep. For a chance to participate in the giveaway, all you have to do is subscribe to this channel, like this video, and leave a comment below. Hashtag Shiba Inu. Good luck. As I just mentioned, other people seem to be people seem to be excited about the new developments too because Sheep keeps adding on thousands of new holders daily. When you consider the fact that the crypto market hasn't been at its best for a while now, you have to agree that the upcoming projects have to be the reason why these new holders have been joining. Between June 12th and July 11th, about 21,000 new holders have bought Sheep, bringing the total number of Sheep holders to about 1,199,539. What this means is that SHIB has been able to recover all the holder losses that it experienced back in March. According to Finbull, the token lost about 32,000 holders between March 16th and March 17th, dropping the total number of SHIB addresses from 1,199,453 to 1,166,621. But with the number of SHIB holders now at almost 1.2 million, SHIB has effectively recouped its losses. Whatever you decide to do with all that has been said is completely up to you, but you could share your opinions with us in the comment section below. While you do that, bear in mind that the comment section is not for financial advice. Please do not make financial decisions based on what you hear in the comment section. Make sure to do your own research before doing anything. Now that we're all clear on that, let's get to the general crypto news. While some people seem to believe that Bitcoin is at the lowest that it ever can, Wall Street believes differently. Recent information says that the coin will drop even further, going as low as $10,000. Actually, a survey was conducted by Bloomberg and the results showed that 60% of the respondents believe that Bitcoin will drop further to 10 k This position seems to be influenced by current happenings in the financial market. According to you today, the central bank is on track to announce another 75 basis point rate hike this month to inflation. Rate hikes have critical implications for risk assets of the likes of Bitcoin. Now, before you panic, bear in mind that this is just people's opinion. Plus, 60% is the majority, but isn't everybody. About 40% of the respondents actually believe that Bitcoin is going to reclaim the $30,000 level, so that's something to think about. Something else that you want to bear in mind is that people might be spreading this news of an impending price dip for Bitcoin as a way of manipulating the market. That is, it could be that some people, probably people with deep pockets, want people to think that Bitcoin will drop really low so that holders can sell off their holdings in a panic and then they can swoop in and buy. Now, of course, this is speculation. It's really just my opinion. But things like this have happened before and they can happen again. So it's really something to think about. But once again, whether you decide to stock up on your holdings, sell, or continue to hodl, you want to make sure that you have done your own research. It's your own money after all. With that, we come to the end of this video. If you enjoyed the video, then please like this video and don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section. This really helps me with the YouTube algorithm. Also, please share this video to as many people as possible. Let's get this news out there. If you're a true Shiba Inu fan, then you must check out this video.